What's up everybody, today I'm gonna show you how to change a strut mount, a broken strut mount or a strut base, I don't know how you call it, but it's broken and I'm gonna show you how to change it. So important tools to have for this job in this lancer, these, these strut tools, I don't know the name of, of, of this, but these things, a wrench, a 17 wrench, but this is style not like the normal one like this one it's this is style this is 17 and a normal 8, eight millimeters and 19 19 sorry 19 millimeters and a socket 19 so the first thing we are going to do is to use these tools and we are going to put it in the spring because the spring is forcing the strut down and we can take off these two bolts right here so this bolt right here is to see if with this we can pull these two bolts but we can't so after taking off this strut we are going to take out the mount with a 14 millimeter so as you can see I already take it off and I'm gonna show you how it was everything set up in here for me to take it out so everything was like this this spring clamp here and the other one right here and I take the hose clamps and the hose the hose the hose clamp the spring clamps sorry tight the spring compress the spring and let me remove this from the knuckle of the car and that, uh, yes, and I'm gonna show you the broken part right here. You can see broken part. This was a Chinese one, I think, and broke. So, so yes, I'm gonna show you how to put the new one. So you can see I have here the new part. You can see it's not broken. It's original from Mitsubishi. This is the number part. If you want it. This, this is the one so yes now I'm going to put everything together again and obviously I'm gonna show you so you can see I have the strut right here the spring this rubber part right here also have a rubber part in here this steel part and this bearing this strut bearing and on top of, of everything the new part is going to set so now I'm gonna use the spring compressors uh, in both sides one in both sides and I'm gonna compress the spring for the strut right here so as you can see this is how I put it right here I put the nut and I'm gonna tie, tie even more than not when it's on the car because this thing is spinning and I can tie the, the knot more than that it is right now so you can see I have it here these ones, these knots are, are with 14 millimeters now you put the 17 wrench right here and with the 8 you're gonna grab right here and then with the 17 you are going to turn it to tight everything so I finish tightening this and now I'm going to put everything right here remember to put the brake line in her place with a clip with this clip right here and I'm going to with the jack I'm going to leave the knuckle a little bit for the bolt to enter in the holes of the strut so as you can see I have everything ready to torque it I'm gonna torque these two bolts to 115 115 pound feet of torque and this ones to 33 pound feet of torque to lift this you need to lift it from the control arm so, as uh, you can see, everything is on the car again, the car is on the ground, 
here it's also everything tight here so i hope you like this video like subscribe and see you in the next video